Now, it's your turn, says Ash Ketchum, to the new protagonist out here. That's a big burden for that new protagonist. I don't know how she's going to take on 25 years of experience for a 10-year-old who's retiring at the age of 10. <laughs> Perhaps 11. I have no idea how that's going to go on. Yo, what's cracking, gamers? And welcome to another Pokemon meme video. It's your boy out here with his millions and millions of Eevees. And good news. I actually caught a shiny Vaporeon last night. It's male, okay? No funny business, all right? I, you guys have the dirtiest mind. It's it's male. The don't say it makes it better. But yeah, you know, after a four-hour uh, session of shiny hunting and getting absolutely nothing out of it. Okay, well, I did find a shiny, but then this happened in it. I just, I just want the W, man. <gasps> no, 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 no! Oh, sh- But anyway, if you guys like these kinds of videos, did you know that only 6.96969 repeating of you guys are subscribed to that notification bell? So, you know, a little bit of love goes a long way. Anyway, let's get to it. Nimona out here. Let's just have some fun. Yes. And then yes, Nomona is the only option. <laughs> when battle is the only option. <laughs> You know, while Nimona may be, you know, crazy, she was in the tolerable range of crazy out there, you know? Still kind of cute, and but still crazy in the tolerable level. She, she was not like Yuno Gasai level, so, you know, I kind of enjoy her. Oh, Sprigatito looking at Meow Scarada, and wait, it's a dog Scarada. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. It was a lie all along. Is that mask actually removable? I... I don't know. <laughs> um, excuse me, Miss Miriam. We might need some help here. Oh, uh, did our champions train too hard again? <laughs> what the frick? <laughs> I didn't mean to. I, didn't mean, no, no. I like how the eye glitch is in there, too. That's a nice little reference there as well as everything. Yeah, yeah. I have never run into those glitches. Only the crashing and burning glitches. And that one's a little bit rarer nowadays. I really like this one, though it scares me at the little time out here where it's a gang of Tinkatons and Tinkas Tinks and all the others just riding their Cyclozars into battle. <laughs> that's, that's horrifying. So we have a little theory out here of, you know, the new protagonist has that weird little symbol on the head out there. Kind of looks like Ash Ketchum's hat symbol. It's, it's a little bit different. I don't even know if that symbol was ever really explained. Was it explained, Potato? <laughs> Oh, fascinating. Okay. Chansey, wait. Chansey? As a Marilla? All right. See you later. <laughs> it's happened before, just, just sliding down the cliff. Some of the Poke battles are a little bit weird. A little bit rough around the edges still. Yeah. Oh. They catch a Noi Bat out here. Eh, I caught one of those in Sunny Moon. That's pretty cool. All right. What's the Halucha doing? Hey, yo! <laughs> he just kicked it for you. That was very nice of him to do. Wasn't that just so nice of him? Hey, Mella, check out this meme. Goth girls and their shoes are just enormous. Why is that funny, Guacamo? Oh, uh, uh, why is that funny, Guacamo? <laughs> She's got big shoes. I don't know why she wears such big shoes. She still has, like, that funny walking animation. I still can't get over her funny little walk animation. It's cute. Oh, we have a battle. All right, then. You are challenged by Mario. He throws it out. All right. Well. Oh. Oh. Well, bye-bye, Tinkatub. Bye-bye, <laughs> Tinkatub. Just like Butterfree, I guess. But now it's gonna be Ash Ketchum. Uh, hey, what if we battled, like, right here, <laughs> right now? <laughs> just, just kidding. <laughs> That's silly. But wouldn't it be crazy, though? Unless... <laughs> I mean, that's actually kind of cute and slightly hot at the same time, but also it's a mix of emotions going on inside of me right now. Why do I like the motor? Oh god, you bailed out on me, Potato. He was out! I'm not hopeless, buddy, okay? I'm not hopeless. Ash and Serena's daughter. Ash and Dawn's daughter. Ash and Lana's daughter. Ash and Serena's daughter. Ash and Misty's daughter. A completely new character. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh man, yeah, Poke shippers are going crazy right now. It's absolutely a warfare. I honestly have no idea what's gonna go on here. So I'm very, very curious to see where this is going to go. It's like 25 years of Pokemon, man. It's older than maybe some of y'all watching right now. That's anime history, man. Oh shit. Here we go again. <laughs> this is what I got to do. Oh, I know what this is going. You know, the funny thing is, though, you never found her just out in the field. But then again, you can't really predict where the character is going to go in open area games just to fight them randomly. So, yeah, I get that. You know, always in front of the gym battles and other things like that. But still, I thought it would have been cool to, like, her maybe encounter and you battle in the middle of the open. I feel like that would have been cool. So tell him, Flame, it has top-notch flying capabilities. It flies around easily, even while carrying prey that weighs more than 220 pounds. And Tinkaton, the hammer it tops 220 pounds. Wait a minute, that's... Oh. <laughs> so he can carry the mallet when the bird fights back. Although the bird was never really in any danger, you know, because it's not made of metal. Tinkaton just wants metal things, so... Yeah, okay. I can't believe he didn't cry during the Titanic. Do men even have feelings? In the final chapter in Ash and Pikachu's story. <laughs> Hold it in. I know, I know. Stay strong, little buddy. Ash and Pikachu's dream has finally come true, and Ash has become a Pokemon master. New characters will keep their file the fire alive. Like, nice. No more Jesse James and Meowth, though. You know, I didn't quite address that in my video about Ash not being there anymore, and yeah, that is a little bit sad, I am, admittedly, that is actually kind of sad. I hope they get like a nice, nice little conclusion too. They deserve it. You need to touch grass. And then me being like, okay. And the grass being, all right, dude. Okay, dude. Someone's got a fetish out there. I mean, but you know, like, Zarina just it was pretty good. <laughs> I don't know about that Roserade thing, though. I don't know. You keep that away from me. You, you, you can have that one. So this is in the game. I'm reading a thrilling novel about a man and his god of war. Really? Really, Pokemon? You know what you were doing. You know right well what you were doing. So Karida and Miradon saying like, this is some serious gold made shit. <laughs> oh man. You know what? You gotta be some unnatural freak not to like sandwiches. Really? Sandwiches are just beautiful. Chef's kiss. Give me a sandwich. Give me more sandwiches. I need all the sandwiches. All right, so you know, you guys have your Pokemon theories and stuff like this, but I actually have a true Pokemon theory out here about the new character. All right, so you see, she has the symbol on Ash's hat. Yeah, that that we understand. But the eyes, though, they're directly linked to Vaporeon. I'm not sorry. Ah, uh, here we have the famous Reggie Peep. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> you can just hear the noises coming out of it. <laughs> Before Pokemon Journeys, and Ash with his harem of girls and stuff, and then during Pokemon Journeys, yo, bro, hey, bro, what's up with the go? You, you, you. And then after Pokemon Journeys, back at it again, <laughs> just like we were just beginning. Yep, it's gonna be rough for him. I honestly, I don't think that Pokemon's gonna give him a girl. It's possible. But I've been wrong before. I, you know what? I'm not gonna make a theory. I, I've been wrong too many times. Behold, the awesome power of terrestrialization. Palmy, use thunder shock. Opa! <laughs> doesn't give a crap. Whoopa just don't give a crap. He's ground type. Yeah, it's like, doesn't really work on ground types out there. I mean, you could use it all you want out there, but just, just don't work. Good old whooper. He really is just one of the cutest Pokemon. I'm so glad that they brought him back, and he's so useful. He was great for me, and he was adorable and stupid looking and looked like poop, and I loved him. Arceus, please, Galar. Hi. Where am I, says the Rookie D. Paldea region. Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, it's not steel type at that point there, so she needs the steel. Rookie D should be fine. Oh my god, there's so many Arcanines. And a guard shop, okay. Oh, a little roar back there and just... Hey, where'd he go? Oh. 
Oh hi. <laughs> what you looking at, brother? <laughs> you look you looking at my homies, man? What you what you making this weird? <laughs> what the frick Arcanine, bro? So here we have a Toad's cool on a stool. And this is Toad's cool on a stool. It just crosses the legs. That's how he sits on the thing. <laughs> it's cute to me. I don't know. It reminds me of Squidward slightly too. Oh hey, it's that little sushi Pokemon inside of the the big whale and well, it just doesn't know what it's going to like. Oh, these guys need to make up their mind. <laughs> this is why you only have one commander and not several commanders in there, okay? And that's going to be all for a little Pokemon meme session on here. Hope you guys enjoyed this out here. I may have gotten incredibly unlucky last night with all of my freaking shiny hunting. I got completely unlucky. Like, I, I got completely destroyed. In fact, even my light died, which is why I'm not as goodly lit right now, too. So I have to get a new light. <laughs> So you know what? Hey, uh, a like for this video would definitely help me out. Maybe a like for Potato. And I got plenty of other Pokemon vids, plenty of more. If you want to see some more fun content, check those out. And I'll see you beautiful sons of guns again next time.